Yo, Bose, this is we to play the Printer Brushworks of YouTube rats. Before we start to Animal Crossing New Horizons, there's something I absolutely need to get off my chest. Remember... I don't even remember his name, but remember that character I was dealing with at the very beginning? Gulliver? Gulliver on... Episode 3 and 4, days 3 and 4. On day 4, after I turn off the camera, I couldn't find all the components. I dug up the entire beach. I dug up every grain of sand I could. And I could not find three of the components at all. I thought, hey, maybe if I fish... Maybe there's components in the water. No, I didn't find one. Not one single one. I found a new fish to put in the museum. But I spent four plus hours trying to find these components. And I couldn't even find them all. I have never been so upset about something like this in an Animal Crossing game, but this legit ruined my mood. Because I couldn't finish it. I put so many hours into it, and I couldn't finish it. So I don't know what I'm going to do. Hello, everyone. This is Tom Nook. It's 1.57 p.m. this happy Thursday, March 26, 2020. There really is not much news today, I figured, so instead I'll share some valuable tips about Isle Revised Living. Have you been using Nook Stop inside residential services? You can earn bonus miles once a day just by accessing it. Using it multiple days in a row will give you even more miles, so make sure you check in every day. That's all for me. Bye now. So yeah, there's not much happening. The good news is I actually found plenty of Brocks before I got completely burnt out by the whole Gulliver thing. That I think I only need three or two more iron ore and then I can finally... I really mean this. Finally update... well not update. Get a Nook Cranny in this place. So, that's going to be my task today, I guess. Get some stuff from the Nook Mileage Program. Ah, yes, I know what this is. This would be the rug that I ended up ordering. A Nook Incorporated rug. I guess I could just put that in my house now. I did a little bit of organizing. Looks a little bit more nicer. Almost. I'm going to take these with me right now. Just so I don't forget them later. Spread out the rug. That's not quite where I want it, but I'll move it later. Also, I need to pick up the Akarnia at some point. Oh my gosh, I said it again! Community question. How long do you think it will take until I can say ocarina correctly? That's the community question. I am so sorry that that happens to be the case. Ugh, I'm burnt out. At least the Nintendo Direct Mini gave me a little bit more to hope for. Welcome, Brenton. How can I help you today? Well, what you got for sale this time? Probably most of the same things, except he's also got a sleeping bag and a barbecue. But yeah, all the rest of this is just the same old, same old. But we'll be fixing that very, very soon. Let me just look in here. There's nothing in here. Let me just check my inventory. Yep. Yep. Oh, wait. They're rusted now? Oh, crudded. So now I can't even give them the Gulliver because they don't even work. Water damage or something like that. What the heck? 
I spent hours on this mission. Hours! The only other clue I got was I need to dig in suspicious places. What? What's a suspicious place? Huh? Huh? What's a suspicious place? I am legitimately frustrated and angry about this Gulliver mission. I, I just don't know what to say about it. I just don't... I don't know. It's my least favorite thing about this game. My least favorite thing about any Animal Crossing game, to be honest. But say, I mean, that's an option. That's your fault if you get Mr. Assay to show up and hassle you. But the Gulliver one is almost kind of mandatory. And considering I went out of my way to try to make it happen, also I probably, probably should buy a different flimsy axe, I'm gonna be honest. Considering I went out of my way to try to complete Gulliver's Travels for the second day in a row, and no matter what I did, no matter how much of the beach that I shoveled out, I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. It was just impossible. The game wouldn't let me. I don't know. What I'm going to try to do from now on with these videos is show what happened the day before on its in their own separate little timeline. On the same video. I'm not going to cut this video or anything, but I'm going to show exactly some of the moments that I enjoyed and moments that made me want to rage quit. And technically I did rage quit. I really did. Tell me if you know what I'm doing wrong with the Gulliver missions because uh, I just don't want to do that again. I just don't. Okay, I need two more of the iron ore. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. Finally, something good. And I don't mean just a museum. Which, in case you couldn't tell, I have gotten rid of every single fish, bug, and fossil in my home or outside of my home. So that's all been taken care of. They're all at the museum living happy lives, or at least looking good in display. So hopefully, today, after this episode's done, I will showcase more of the museum. I wanted to do that earlier, but after the whole... goal thing, I just couldn't. Ooh! Praying Mantis! I've seen this thing only one at a time. Please don't scare it off, Tommy. Or Timmy. Whoever you are, don't scare it off. I don't have this one yet. Shoot, 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 shoot. Are you kidding me? Tommy, why? How are you enjoying island life? Did you know you can dig up flowers? Starts with a shovel? Plus, the garden needs watering can, a shovel, and patience. You almost made it go away. Okay. Okay, got it. Jeez, that scared me. I call a mantis. Mantis, so cool. Mantis. Okay, cool. <laughs> Gosh dang these puns. Oops. Might as well catch you too. I'm surprised you didn't fly off. Cause stink bug, it lives up to its name. That's not even a joke. It's just. It just is. So, what am I doing? Okay, I guess there's the message in the ball. Let's see what the message and DIY recipe is today. Dear Mysterious Stranger, I did DIY and got the stuff wrong. So I made this on accident. Man, I tell you, I'm all accidents today. It's real easy. My hair was stuck in my shirt and I still did the DIY. Share the recipe with folks. Rodeo, a.k.a. D-I-Y-M-A-N. Perfect. Stone table. Okay. Oh, wait, no. Stone table. I was thinking stone chair. So I don't know this one. 
I was about to shirk it off, but nope. Well, that would be nice to put out in the yard. Maybe just a nice place to do a picnic. Although, having a picnic table would be better. Okay, so I've got all the material I need. Also, homes. I got all the materials I need in order to put the Nook's Cranny project into effect. So, let's start that one up now. Welcome, Brenton. How can I help you today? About building a shop. Right now, we're asking residents for their help in donating the materials we need to build the shop. I probably could have talked to the residents. Oops, I've been doing a terrible job with that. I'd like to donate. Oh, you'll make a donation? Thank you so much for helping us. Let's see, you brought in... Oh my, you brought in everything we need, all at once! Are you really going to provide all four kinds of materials right now? Well, I went out of my way to do it, so... Take it. Take it. Oh my goodness! This means we have everything we need to get started on our shop! As a thank you, please take a throwback mitt chair, a retro fan, and a mounted black bass. Oh neat. I got some stuff in return. That's kind of cool. One more thing. Since we have all the materials we need and can start construction on the shop, We'd like you, a key figure in making this happen, to pick out the perfect location for a new shop. Well, it probably shouldn't be across the river this time. Place that shop construction kit wherever you like, and we'll get started on construction. I'm so excited to see the location you picked for us. Well, I kind of want it to be close to the camp. So... Somewhere over here, maybe? I'm not sure. I guess I could kind of see it here. It's close enough. Let's see what we got. Well, hold on. Not, not right here. Not exactly right here. I want this tree gone first. Although, then there's the pear tree right there. <laughs> okay. How about... Well, I can't win. Do I still have that axe? Of course I don't. Gosh dang it. Okay, you know what? Let's build it right here. No takesy backsies. Right here. Even though I can't see the rock right there. Maybe two more paces over this way. Right here. Let me imagine it. Might have to move the pear tree. No, no, actually this is good. Perfect. This is the perfect spot for this. Heck yeah! This is where the shop will go. I bet this iron is about to become a whole lot livier. Livelier, excuse me. Well, I hope so. We've only had two neighbors for how many days now? <gasps> Frick! Well, my hair stood up again. Sorry, sorry about that. Wondered what kind of fish I'm going to meet today. I hope they're nice. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I threw the bug net at her. It was understandable when I was trying to catch the mantis and Tommy happened to poke his head over there, but... Other than that, that wasn't good. Um... Okay, where is my shovel? There it is. Let me dig up more of these clams, because now I get an accomplishment for that. I guess that's what I'll focus on for right now. Shouldn't be too hard. At least all the holes disappeared again. I'm happy about that, at least. Um, is there one right here? Perfect. 
Vanilla clam. My favorite flavor. Nice vanilla. Guess I'll pick up some seashells. Yeah, not much is going to happen, but at least I've got the shop happening now. I'm not sure how and when I'm going to be able to build other things on this island, such as bridges. I especially want bridges. I guess maybe once the shop is up, something will happen? I'll just have to see what happens. Dang it, missed. Is it gonna pop up again? Yes, it is. Okay. Got a manila clam. Perfect. How much more space do I have? None. Alright, cool. Well, I can talk to her. Him. Excuse me, him. Afternoon, Bunyip. You doing good? Let's talk, because we haven't done that in a long time. Guess what? I finally own something that even I have trouble lifting. Yep, I have a house now, Bunyip. It's got walls, a floor, even a ceiling. I can finally do jumping jacks without ripping a hole in my home. Hmm, <laughs> that, was, that was TMI there. Good job getting a house, though. I mentioned it earlier, and I wanted to go inside the houses and talk to them, but like I said, Britain, you put the shop construction kit. We've got work cut out for us if we're going to open by tomorrow, but I can't wait. How can I help you this time? Well, I want to sell stiff. It's not like I need a bunch of fish bait. So I'll sell all this, a wasp net, nest, not net, tiger beetle, and I think that's about it. What is this? Ah, that's the amount of black bass. I should take a look at the items before I in off today. Also, I'm a little bit closer to paying off rent. I know I talked about maybe doing it in one day, but I didn't quite hit that milestone. But I got quite a bit paid off. See, now I'm only 93,000 bells short. We were in six digits before, but... I gave a lot of fish away. I sold a lot of the fish that I caught while looking for those component pieces. Speaking of which, I almost am wanting to know, although probably not that much, I'm almost wanting to know if Goldliver is here today. I don't think he is, but I don't know. I just don't know what happened with that. I figured if I dug up every piece of sand that I would be able to find all the component pieces. Though in the middle of that I was thinking, huh, he said they're at the beach. He didn't say they're all necessarily buried in the sand. Well, I guess technically he did later on. But I dug up all the sand. And I only found two of the three pieces. Took me a long time to find the second one. Let alone how long it took for the first one. I always showcase that. But... I'm just really irked about the whole thing. Again, let me know if I did something wrong. Give me advice. I just... Absolutely did not enjoy that one bit. It put a damper on my mood. One good thing, though, is since I ended up donating a fossil, just one, to... What's his name? Blathers. Now I can donate multiple items at once, just like I could in the new games. 
as well as access multiple fossils. Have him look at all the fossils at one time. And I'll be able to donate them all at once. Okay, hold on. I hear the present. Aha. I've recognized the sound of the wind carrying a gift. Uh-oh. Okay, <laughs> it's behind the tree. I almost thought maybe it landed in the tree. It's like, do I have to shake this tree? Ooh, 10,000 bells! Heck yeah! You have to work harder today, considering I didn't even bother watering the flowers the last time I was playing this. I just rage quit after a while of fishing and after I did all that stuff I already told you about. I don't think there's anything more I need to say until I show you the footage that I took. So, oh, also I left the clam here. Whoops. I think this is the next money tree, if I remember right. Don't shake it. There's no bells in there. Stop. You're going to make the thing tip over. That wouldn't be good. There we go. Well, I was going to check the beach, wasn't I? I got distracted by the present. Um, thought I saw a weed over here, but I guess not. Let's check the beach, see if my good old friend, who has a bad sense of humor, is here. Nope, he's gone. I guess the boat took him away. But hey, I got two rusted component parts. Maybe I'll find some use for it? Maybe? I don't know. Probably not, but you never know. Um, there we go. Vanilla clam. Any more of them? I know there's other things I could be doing with my time, but hey, couldn't I say that about anything I do? Well, let's catch a fish. I'm going to guess that this might be a yellow perch. Let's find out. Nope, it's a squid. It's off the hook. Na 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 na. Long Splatoon theme. There's another saying as well. So there's three different. Um, lines. Three different clips with squid that I've found so far. So that's kind of... Wow. He just jumped into the hole I made. Well, happy trails, friend. Yeah, there's really not much happening at all. I guess I could see what this fish is. Once I get enough um, of the... I always forget what it was. Oh, this is a yellow perch. <laughs> My bad. Yellow perches are in the river. How could I be so naive? I always forgot what I was trying to say. Oh, well... I guess I'll sell some of this stuff. Oh, there's a fossil here. Okay. I'll just dig that up, too. I'll probably give away all of the fossils to bladders off-screen. But what I will do... Trying to figure out what I'm doing right now. What I will do is I will 
to give away the mantis on screen, and we'll find out together what Blaz has to say about mantises. I'm pretty sure he won't be thrilled, but that'll be fun to watch. But first, let me sell some of this stuff. Oops, wrong button. Let's try that again. I love doing that. Over and over again. Uh, let's see. Sell squid, sand dollar, clumpus weeds. I still want to see what that stuff is. Tiger butterfly. And that is it, I believe. One thousand two hundred and twenty bells. Not bad. Or 1,220 bells, however you want to say it. What the? Oh, I guess that's a tree. I thought there was someone over at the construction site doing something. I'm not even sure what they would be doing. Well, let me take a look at my three items. See if they're worth keeping around or not. Uh, start off with the mounted black bass. I need to hang down the wall somewhere. Maybe right by my bed. Nothing says have a good night like a dead fish on the wall. Does it make noise? I can't touch it. Dang it. Aw, it's not a boogie bass. I'm bummed. Got a retro fan. Oh, gosh. I already hate it. That is way too loud. But at least it'll keep me cool during the summertime. And a throwback mitt chair. I don't know what this is. Well, they said mitt, as in baseball mitt. It's nice. I think it kind of clashes with the rest of the house. I mean, even the couch looks more natural than this silly thing does. But, at least I've added it to my inventory, so maybe one day, when I actually get a catalog... I'm not sure how that works, but one day I'll be able to get the mitt chair back for a theme that I'll have. Okay, so what we got here? Cord reward! I'm gonna be on the next episode of Hoarders, guys. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Um, okay, let me... Go to the Critterpedia quickly. There's the Mantis. Here are some of the other ones that I've gotten. Few of them being a little bit more rare than others. Especially with fish. See, off screen, I caught a sturgeon. I'd say next to the oarfish. And this very interesting barrel eye. Which I end up finding. Looks like it's pretty hard to find. Only comes at night time. I've got some pretty good catches. I gotta say. Oh, hold on. Butterfly's coming to me. I might as well try to catch it. I said try. I said try. I'm gonna catch you. I'm going to catch you. You are worth a few bells. Don't you dare fly to the other end. Get in the net. Sheesh. I'm earning my stripes, folks. Earning all them stripes. They're great. Boy, I forced that one in. Here's where a tree used to be, now it's just a stump that you can sit at, right in front of the museum. I could have just removed the stump, but I don't know, I, I kind of like it there.
Well, I'm going to donate the mantis, and then I'm pretty much going to call it a video, because, like I said, not much happening. Ooh! Oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Brenton. Welcome to Isle Revised Museum. How may I be of service? Also, I can have them talk to me about certain stuff I have. If I'm holding it in my pocket, so that's nice. But we're just going to make the donation and then he can blather on about it. After I give it to him. Yeah, blathers! Happy Hanukkah! Eee, got mantis! What a wretched thing! Alas, I'm obliged to ask, would you like to learn more about this specimen? Oh, please do, Bladders, please do. Oh, I see. In that case, um, oh, don't let the mantis angelic pose fool you, for it is truly monstrous. The mantis is known for its large size and tremendous strength, and for sickle-like arms to pack a punch. And though they tend to eat bugs and spiders, mantises have even known to dine on small animals, too! Oh, no! Not my tapping! And those eerie eyes! Oh, my! Did you know it has five of them? Two big ones and three small? He's gonna hate it when I have him talk about the tarantula one-day catch. I shall faint if I think of it any further. Anywho, my sincerest thanks for your donation. And though bugs are a bane of my existence, rest assured the wretched thing will get the best of care here. Is there anything else I can help with? Not right now. Well, actually not. You can access all my fossils at once. What will you have me assess? I'm all a flutter. So I can pick not one, but every fossil I have. And he'll be able to identify it all in one go. More than one, I see. Let us take a closer look, shall we? Hooray! I found something that is not yet part of our established esteemed collection. Which means there's something that I already donated to him. Hmm. It's magnificent indeed. You have a talent for finding the finest of fossils. Now, I do hope you will consider donating what you found. The cultural development of Iowa Revised is a worthy endeavor indeed. In the meantime, I shall return these to you, but think about what I've said. The museum awaits. And I await to record footage of the museum. But for now, I'm fine. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. Thanks, Bladders. Good boy. Wow, I almost expected him to fall asleep while I was walking away. He's probably asleep now. Okay, so before I end off, now I gotta do the bitter news. I gotta showcase stuff that happened after yesterday's video and talk about it. So what we got here? <laughs> Animal City. I didn't actually record it, but it's basically the theme for the city from Animal Crossing City Folk. I wanted to know exactly what the name of the song is, so if I ever find that soundtrack, I could buy it or ask K.K. Slider for it. Not sure when I'll get K.K. Slider to come. And then this happened. I heard this familiar theme. It's it's a staple of certain games, including the first time I ever heard it, which was Mario Paint. And it is called KK Song. At least in this game. The real name for the song, I it escapes me right now, but it's seen and heard from various video games. Um, this is where he talks about accepting multiple donations all at once, which is nice. And this is the bane of my existence. Trying to find a stupid component. 
Remember, it already took so long just to find the first one. And then there's Tommy. Watch Tommy. He looks at me, and then he walks away with a side glance. I don't think he liked what I was doing to the beach. It made me feel bad. Clam and Collected. Dig up clams, collect Tom Nook Miles. It's really that simple. The real bonus here is that you get to walk along the beach for this one. So now I get Miles for getting clams. And this is after I dug up every single bit of beach I could get. All I could do was take a picture of myself saying, why, and keep it. But this was when I caught the barrel eye, like I'm fish in a barrel. And I'm not sure what this was for. Maybe this was for when I ca caught the barrel eye? I think it was. Oh no, I know what this is for. This is when I fell into one of my own holes. Mmm, feels extra bad. Rip with a capital R. Um, I caught some bugs on this rock. And then there's Gulliver. Not being helpful at all. Hey, communicator parts, come out, come out wherever you are. Then I caught the wharf roach. This war-loving roach has no peer. And I'm not sure what happened here. Maybe this is where I caught the... Yep, yep, this is where I caught that fish I was just talking about. Ooh, barracuda! Except it's not. This would be the sturgeon! Yes! Cause sturgeon. Wonder if it can perform surgery. Huh? And then there's Gulliver again. They must be buried in the sand somewhere. Keep your shovel handy and dig up any odd spots. I, I don't know what was odd. Was I supposed to be looking for a sparkle? I didn't see anything. Anything. And like I said, I never, ever completed that mission. It is the saltiest moment in any Animal Crossing game for me. Period. So, that's my findings, and that's all I have to show for today. I'll just be gathering up materials, and hopefully I'll have better um, items, like an actual shovel, fishing pole, bug net, after I've crafted it using the iron ore. That's what I was trying to remember. So, look forward to that. I'm guessing the next episode may be a live stream. I don't know for sure, but I'm guessing it could be a live stream. So, if it is, hopefully I get to visit a lot of you. I'm hoping especially to visit Superior Lover. I'll shoot them a message if it does happen. But until then, and until my next videos, this has been We The Play. I got nothing left to say. So I hope you enjoy your day. Catch you later.